Yeah, you knew you were going to wake up to uh, headlines like these, right? These are from Houston, New York, Chicago, all calling out the Astros after the MLB did the same. And if you somehow missed this yesterday, it started when the league punished the team for sign stealing in the 2017 season. $5 million fine. First and second round draft picks gone for the next two years. GM Jeff Lunau and manager AJ Hinch suspended. So after that came the next hit. Owner Jim Crane fired Lunau and Hinch. We cleaned house. It's behind us and we're going to make this right and we're going to play baseball. So a lot of fans actually agreed with that saying, hey, if someone within my organization cost me $5 million, uh, I'd fire them in a heartbeat. Here are the two statements from Hinch and Lunau, a little different tone. So this is Hinch. He personally apologizes, saying he is deeply sorry. Lunau kind of takes responsibility and then just calls out players and lower level employees. A lot of people online commenting, he's basically just throwing them under the bus. So after this news, after Sunday's Texans loss, we're asking, is this the worst week in Houston sports history? You can weigh in on KHAU.com and on our mobile app. As far as those punishments are concerned, Fans are really split. A lot of folks are saying it is too harsh and unnecessary, but some folks say, yeah, it was necessary because now we are on the record as being cheaters. Even Mark, who says he is a lifetime fan, says this organization is done. And what's crazy to think about is the punishments aren't over yet. There are gonna be more names more stuff handed down. Well, go ahead. Sorry, go ahead. Well, talk about the names that are, are coming out. Well, Alex Cora, yeah. who, who worked with the Astros now with the Red Sox, um, we're waiting to see because that no doubt that's, is going to be handed down. That's the biggest name mm -hmm. that well, everybody's talking well, about. Well, to me, yeah. yesterday, it was just shocking how one thing happened from the NLB, and then all of a sudden, like, when an hour later, Crane comes out with his announcement that they're going to be fired. It was just a, a crazy day, a crazy 48 hours for Houston sports. You got to think they had, they knew something was coming because those statements were prepared very quickly. Absolutely. Oh yes, they were. I know Blake had some thoughts about this earlier, but Blake, what's the